Hello, good afternoon. My name is Bahamid. I'm in this video. I'm going to show you how to fill out a certificate of amendment of the certificate of assumed name. Now, this is for amendments only. If you need to amend this, that's all it's for. Uh, for new, it's on another, another application if you plan to open up a new business. But this is for amendment only. So this is how it works. The name of the entity, the na real name of the entity is, for example, if you st if you start a business on uh, John's uh, Cake Industry. That's the real name of the entity. Now, four entities only. This is for four entities. If, if you don't have that read here. Now, number third. If the real name of the entity is different on the last certificate of assumed name or certificate amendment of certificate of assumed name, the previous name of the entity is the old one. You put it over here. The real name, the old one over here. Fourth. What was it? Was it a business corporation law? Uh, is it an education law? And insurance law, limited liability, non for profit, revised limited, whatever it is, you put it down. And you put the real one over here, the real name, the not the wrong one, the whichever the real name is. For example, you're doing an amendment, so you obviously you need to real name over here, real name over here, the fake one, or the incorrect one over here. Fifth, the present assumed name is what's the present one currently? The, la the date the original certificate of assumed name was filled is what the, the date the original certificate of the assumed name was. What was it? The date of applicable the last certificate of amendment the certificate of assumed name was filled is you put that down number eight the following changes are being made entity name assumed name principal name of business that's one that's number two county's address of specific business location and deleted you have to put down the address you sign here title of the signer what are you owner CEO or president obviously make sure you do that uh, then you, you had to fill out the third page insert the real name of entity again you put the real name your father's name city and address and obviously that's how it is uh, it's $25 fee over here just like it states make sure you put that fee um, corporation transaction business $100 for those people uh, you know obviously make sure that you know $25 for each county into outside of New York City all checks over $500 must be certified to make sure I mean these prices do is change so always double check with them so so this is how you fill out a certain minimum amendment with the New York State Department of Education um, New York State I should say division of corporation uh, if you have any other questions or comment concerns please comment like subscribe to my videos I'll be having more education informational videos coming out thank you again for watching the video I hope you guys understand how to fill this out thank you